hello welcome to my channel to all new and returning subscribers you are welcome to this channel in my video today i'm going to be showing you how to add and duplicate region of interest on your image recently i received comments that made me aware that i needed to record this video so there are these two comments one was asking about how to duplicate the region of interest that's the first uh, square box the person is referring to and the second the person was asking about how to get the second third and fourth region of interest which i showed in my tutorial in one of my tutorial in image j on the left hand side of the image j window or fiji window because these two are the same just that fiji is more advanced than image j on this left side you have the different selection tool the first draws a square the second it's an oval or circular selection tool the third is an octo uh, it's a polygon selection tool that you can draw at the specific coordinates that you are interested in and the last one is a freehand selection tool where you can in a single click quickly draw around the region you are interested in so now I'm going to be showing you how to draw your region of interest and duplicating that specific region of interest to get a several copy of that region of interest on your single image. In order to be able to get your duplicated region of interest, click on the type of selection tool you are interested in. So for instance, if you are using the square one, we just draw a square region of interest on one of the region we are interested in. And I also want to draw this region of interest on other area of this image. So to first save the memory of this region of interest, I'm going to go to Analyze, Tools, and select the ROI Manager, which is the ROI Manager. With that, you can either press letter T on your keyboard to add this to the ROI Manager, or you click on this hard. So when you click on that, this region of interest has been saved in on this image now i'm going to show you how to duplicate this region of interest on your image so if i'm interested in moving this region of interest to the other part of this image i'm just going to then move this region of interest and how am i doing this i, I just can see the the arrow of my mouse this cross sign and when it's inside the row it becomes an arrow I just move this into the next region I'm interested in and I'm just going to click on hard. Can you see that that has created the second region of interest and I'm just going to then move this again to the third location and click on hard. So if I then want to see the three region of interest that I have drawn, I'm just going to click on show all and can you see that this automatically draws the three region of interest because the, loc the coordinates of each of these region of interest has been added to the memory of the ROI manager and if I want to paste this three region of interest on this duplicated image on the right I'm just going to click on it again and click on show all and as you can see now we have a region of interest pasted duplicated and on the same exact location in our duplicated image I hope that you found this tutorial useful Another quick shortcut I'm going to show you with the image J so that when you are working, you keep your workflow very quick and simple is how to then, if I'm going to duplicate this image, what I'm going to do is to click on the image and then instead of going to image duplicate, can you see that there is a symbol in front of the duplicate so if you are working with image J, image J will give you the shortcut to out or to perform the task you want on your keyboard so because i'm using a macbook you can see this upper ar um, arrow facing up that's the symbol for the shift this uh beautiful symbol here that is looking like a like a square or should i put it like a uh i, I don't know how to describe that that's the symbol for the control key on the on the keyboard and the letter d so instead of clicking this to duplicate this image i can actually then press the command plus the shift plus letter d on my keyboard 
and then click the enter you can see that also duplicated the image so here i have written the the description so you can see on the images so in order to perform your image duplication the control plus shift plus letter d will duplicate the image like i just finished showing you so i'm going to close that and also instead of coming to the Roy manager if i want to paste my region of interest let's assume i'm interested in this first region of interest i'm pasting it on a different image that doesn't have the region of interest i just then use the shift plus command plus letter e e for egg to paste that and that's how to paste the command of your region of interest on an image i'm also going to close that and the last bit which is to repeat command what do i mean by repeat command so imagine if i want to duplicate this image i have gone to i'm going to press on the command plus shift plus letter d to duplicate that image now if i want to repeat that process one more time i'm just now going to click ctrl r which is ctrl r you see it's bring this brought up that window and now i can duplicate the image so if you are working about with a particular image imagine you've saved the first image and you want to save 10 more and yeah, you don't want to use the you don't know how to use the macro yet you just click pressing ctrl r ctrl r ctrl r until you finish then saving your images Please give this image a thumb, uh, video a thumb up if you enjoy it. And if you are looking to learn more image year tutorial, please subscribe to this channel. I also record image. I also record. Now I'm seeing so much images. Now I also record videos on Word documents, some EndNotes tutorial, and also I share LD recipe, which I've not done for a long time now. And until next time, thank you for watching today's video. Bye.